you find yourself in the Avathul slave pens. Due to the illusion spell, you appear to be just one more harmless captive, waiting to be bound and forced into service. Most of the captives have been freed, and a full riot is underway. Time to search for a way into the slave quarters within House Avathul. A guard captain investigates the racket. What is going on here? Who let these captives out? Get back in your cages now!
This tower, high above the slaves, is filled with priceless and ancient artifacts. The slave pin yards lead down into the main slave quarters. You will only find collared, obedient slaves in here. Slaves cook and clean under a slave master's watchful eye. The slaves in the sleeping quarters are unattended by slave master or guard. Their collars ensure absolute obedience. In the workroom, slaves labor over jobs beneath their drow masters. 
Some are tasked with crafting the collars that will bind the next throng of captives. The slave master quickly calls out, A revolt! An exasperated voice comes with the sound of an opening door. What? These colors are supposed to be infallible! Slaves stand beside large looms of spider silk, weaving fine garments for noble drow. The slave master takes quick note of your bare neck and draws his weapon. What are you doing here? Slaves, capture the entire- The slaves are free of their master's control for now. It is time to face the heart of our fool's power, the Slave Breaker. The sound of skittering marks the next room as House Abathool's Silk Farm. Slaves that have outlived their usefulness feed the spiders here.
An authoritative voice can be heard down the hall. Clean that up, slaves. I don't care if your fingers are bleeding. Your miserable lives mean nothing. New captives await me as we speak. Couldn't wait to give yourself to House Avatul. Very well then. Avathul's slaves in open revolt and their slave-making apparatus in shambles, 